you are welcome to this video tutorials on computer software skills and in this video we will learn how to encrypt multiple documents or files at a time or at once without any individual encryption or to password protect our word document or multiple documents on the computer system and before then let's have a motivational message from this lovely channel and this motivational note or message says to be an expert or a professional in a certain aspect there are certain things you have to note and the first thing is to always be a learner always try to be a learner to be an expert and the second one is learn from your mistakes whenever you make a mistake you learn from your mistakes so that ahead or in the future you correct those mistakes to be an expert and the last or lastly we try to learn from others the more we learn from others and also be a learner we always be a professional or a champion in our territory so these are my motivational message to you and when you have an application of these elements in your life you always be an expert in your arena without further ado let's start our encryption operation this video backs up a lovely comment from Bujipav. if i said the name right or pronounced it very well if not please pardon me and the comment says how to put password to multiple documents at a time and i responded peacefully that i'm going to have a video on that this video is particularly made based on this comment from our cherished viewer so let's jump right in and see how to perform this operation on a desktop i have these files and these files are my word documents you can see that i have the names for all these files i have monday tuesday wednesday thursday and friday and i want to encrypt all these files at once without individual encryption and if you want to learn how to encrypt a word document individually i have a short video on that and i'm going to leave the link of that video in the description below the next thing that we have to do is to create a folder and organize all these files into that folder and also i have a video on how to create folders in different ways and i'm also going to drop that link of that video in the description below and you can check it out so i'm going to create a folder now that we have this folder created let's select all these files and pull them into this folder and now we have our files well organized in this particular folder now the next thing is to open this folder in this main folder which has the name personal files and all these files or all these documents that belongs to us are located in this folder the next thing we have to do is to create another folder which is known as a subfolder so you can move to the menu bar and under the home tab we have this yellow icon which says new folder just have a once click on it and give a favorite name to this folder and we are going to move these files into this subfolder now that we have this also well organized in our main folder i also suggest that the next thing that you have to do is to download the winra app and i'm going to drop the link of that web page that will allow you to download the winra app in the description below so you can click on the link to download the app so now that everything is set up the next thing that you have to do is to select this subfolder which contains our multiple documents then you move to the menu bar and click on this share tab now under the share tab we have these commands and we are going to select the zip command and when you click on the zip command you get this winra archive file that also has the similar name of our subfolder and we are going to maintain the name and press the enter key on the keyboard now the next thing is to open this winra file so you right click and choose open 
and we are going to have this mirror file window open and in this window we have these two folders the first folder is the winra file and the second one is our sub folder we created so we are going to select the first folder and on the menu bar we have this add command so you click on add and you are going to have this beautiful window that says select files to add and in this window we have two files shown or displayed we have the folder and also the winra file and this folder has all the document that we need so we are going to select this folder then we click on ok now after doing so you get this window that says archive name and parameters and in this window we have a lot of options we are going to select the general tab and under the general tab when you come below we have this command that says set password and this is the command we are going to click on it to input our password to encrypt our multiple documents so you left click on this command you have this window that says enter password archiving with password so you enter a memorable password you can use to open your multiple documents then you re-enter the password again if you want to be sure of your password you can click on this checkbox then you know whatever password you've key in into this field after doing so you click on ok then you click on ok in this dialog box now let's close this window now in our main folder we have our sub folder which contains our document and also the archive file which also contains our document now the archive file has the password encryption therefore we are going to delete this subfolder so you left click and hit the delete key on the keyboard and now in this main folder we have only the archive file now to access your document you double click on this then you have this subfolder within this window you double click on this one as well and you are going to have the display of all your documents and all these documents are encrypted so if you want to work with the wednesday file you just click on it and double click and for you to access your document you have to key in the password you use for the encryption so i'm going to type the password in the field of this dialog box and after doing so you click on the ok button and this is going to open your file on your desktop background so this is how to encrypt multiple documents at once with a password using the winral app and you can do this for different kinds of files now i have this folder and when i open this folder i have this subfolder as well and in this subfolder we have an access file a word document a pdf file publisher and also a worksheet and you can also use this same procedure to encrypt multiple files which has different formats that is also going to have the same password you are going to use for them when you follow this sequential procedures to encrypt your document this is how to encrypt multiple documents at a time or at once on your computer system thank you for watching and if this video was of helpful please give it a like share comment and we shall meet in our next video